things just don't get better because you pity yourself. Although things aren't easy, I still preserve my ability to create. That side of me comes from my mother. She was an archaeo engineer. I believe I'm close to finishing what she wrote down. Some sort of cube mechanism. I won't explain in detail how I think it'll work, but I can give you the basics. Light spins rapidly inside the cube and harnesses quantum energy to stream data instantly. It's way ahead of its time. This could save me. I can get accepted to Excel. I have less than four days to get my pitch together. So far, not so good. So, how's your project coming along? Excellent, actually. How bad is it? The not working bad? Ethan. Look, it's just complicated. What are you gonna do? I don't know. Uh, I ran out of the inheritance money. If I can't get it to work by Friday, I'm gonna have to wait another three years. I don't have three years. I'll probably lose the house in one. At least one of us got in. Listen, you're a smart guy. A million times smarter than me. But it's not always about being smart. Sometimes, not getting what you want can be a brilliant stroke of luck. What? You need an extension. Try to call them. An extension? It doesn't hurt to try. You know, this reminds me of a quote that I read. It goes, Someone I love once gave me a box full of darkness. It wasn't until years later that I realized this too was a gift. Yeah, I had a, I had a question about the selection process this Friday. Oh, okay. I can help you out. What questions do you have? It's just that I'm afraid I won't be prepared Friday. Do you guys accept late submissions or have any other contests on the line? I'm afraid not. This is the only one I can see scheduled for a long time. So there's absolutely nothing you can do? 
Ethan. Ethan Rowe. Well, Mr. Rowe, this is what separates the best from the best. If you can't pitch your project in a time given, you're not ready to excel. If this is how my life is going to be, I don't want it anymore. I don't know how you're doing this. If you're trying to scare me, you have my attention. I'm not trying to scare you. Just don't leave. I'll tell you everything you want to know. Just give me time. Okay. Everything you think you know, forget it. Right now you're thinking, who is she? How is she talking to me? You may not know the answer now, but I know you feel it in your bones. You're talking to me through a link. A link? A time link. Oh, I get it. <laughs> You're from a different time. Listen, I don't know how you trolls are doing this, but you guys are getting way more inventive. Okay, um, this is gonna be harder than I thought it would be. Spinning optical interference stirs space-time, Ethan. Are you following me? Who else from your time knows about this? You kept the secret. Me? Then how do you know about it? Because you gave it to me! Okay, let's say you're telling the truth. How would I know? I mean, I'm alone, but I'm not... I'm not this desperate for attention. On December 16, 2026, a solar storm caused a massive power outage over southern Europe. There was a major panic, but eventually, without strain, millions regained power back soon after. But that's tomorrow. I know. So can I talk to you this time tomorrow? How did you know that was going to happen? I just passed, Ethan. This isn't possible. None of this is possible. as a child. You haven't been back since then. You chose not to go home. You chose to struggle. If you continue down this path, your future will never be. I don't have a future. And I'm getting used to that. Are you? I decided to live like this. I made things harder on myself. I wish I could go back home, but... But people move on. People forget. Even the ones you love. How do you know? You are more important than you can comprehend. You just don't know it yet. Daisy. I used to call her PB&J. It seemed like that's all she would eat. I even thought she would turn into one. Have you ever wondered if she thought about you too? That was so long ago. If you can go back, you you can save people with this, right? No, you can't. Not this way. Why not? This device can only be connected as far back as it was turned on. You can't save your mother. Without tragedy, you would have never made this. The desire to do so would be non-existent. I thought... 
thought I knew what I was doing, but this makes me feel like I don't know anything. You don't need to know everything, but you do need to understand this, where all this is coming from. Your mom and others died over this discovery. My mom died over this? How? What they unearthed was a small vessel. And Jesus died was a female entity. Whatever killed the female seems to be the same thing that killed your mother. A form of radiation. At first she appeared to be an ancient human. After looking further, the clothes and the vessel said otherwise. Etched on her uniform was a language they'd never seen before. Do you know what it said? Yes. What was it? It was her name. Her name is Genesis, a time traveler. She's one of us. Your mom back engineered how she got here, and you finished it. Why did she want me to finish this? I don't have all the answers, but I do know it wasn't for you to go back. It's for you to communicate. How long has this been on? Centuries? Maybe millennia. Have you ever been contacted? Far beyond your wildest dreams. Even my dreams. I feel like I'm just a splash in something bigger. Why me? With time, you'll know. Fate would have eventually gotten to point with or without me. I just wanted you to a little sooner. I couldn't stand to see you suffer for another 18 years. If I could help it, I would change it. I can, so I will. So much time wasted. You have a path to follow. And for this one distortion in time, I am here to lead you. It's your destiny. Through your mother, you started the fantasy. I am living proof of that. Who are you? My name is Sam. I'm someone who wanted you to find yourself sooner. Sam. Sam, do you hear me? Sam, are you still there? Sam, please don't go. Sam! Sam! connected through time. The luxury of hope was given to me by my own daughter from the future. I'm not sure what to do next, but I know I need to find Daisy. What I'll tell her, I have no idea. <laughs>